Some kind of has been washed up bum. That's what you're thinking. Sure, who wouldn't? <laughs> but people used to pay to see me. The big bucks they paid. You better believe it, booby. Hey, sit back down! I got a sad friggin' story to tell you. And you're gonna listen. And don't let me see you yawn even once, you hear me? Yeah, I was big. But it ain't like I got that way overnight. Well, actually, that's a lot like that. Should've thought about it before I put the thing on. Didn't know what I was getting into. Which is what I have over you. I've been thinking about nothing but this mask ever since you found it. You were all over the place. To fulfill dreams, a guy's gotta have focus. No, Ben, wait! No, Rick, you wait. For the next issue of Spin. I'll be on the cover, Snacky! And that was the Anchor Hoister, a star on the rise. A shame my chums, Archie and Hugo, weren't there to see it. Stuck somewhere else, they were. Okay, how about we get back to the original question? Why were you calling out to Big Head as if he was your friend? And why do you call him Rick? Okay, Hugo. It's all up to you. Are you gonna sit here like your pal and keep a vow of silence? Or are you going to do what it takes to keep you, both of you, out of trouble? Jail. Even the holding center would be rough on a kid like you. Really. Really rough. Uh, excuse me, Detective Calloway, sir, but <clears throat> that's a bit much, isn't it? What I mean, sir, is that we've been here all night and, uh, really, well, could we talk to a lawyer? Lawyer? Only crooks need lawyers, son. Now you see, that brings me to another point. Unless some charges are in the offing, well, I don't want to seem forceful. Okay, Esquire, beat it. We'll be in touch. Uh, Arch? I'm like, confused. There is little I can do that will ever change that. Right now, let me set my mind to more pressing concerns. Such as, where's Rick? How did it go? See this face? That's how it went. Later, I've got to put in a request for a tail on that Archie kid. It's starting all over again. I think maybe it's time the police knew about the mask. Kathy, that's crazy. All we need is one link to the press and every nut in the city would be after that thing. Oh, so you're trying to avoid a citywide panic, is that it? Or are you just afraid of the competition? But this tearjerker ain't about my friends, is it? Honey, whoever told you that you could sing? Because I would just like to beat that person into oblivion. Who's next on the list? Screw that list! The speed metal messiah just walked in. And he could just march right back out, sugar. No additions. Shut the yap, happy pants, or I'll tie it shut with your small intestine. Now, do I play, or do I get ugly? Well, if you put it that way... Smart move, Hollywood. Smart move. See, I had a plan. No goofball showboat and antics for me. Oh, no. Just a one-way express bullet train to double platinum city. So I got right to it. And I want to tell you, that blew the dust off their brains. I set their livers all a quiver. Hell, I peeled their freaking ears off their heads. That's what I did. Okay, maybe they didn't hold up lighters or yell request for Freebird, but they did say, Can you start tonight? Hell, the... We don't even have a smoke machine. Now, I'm not saying I'm the center of the universe. Oh, no. In fact, at that moment, the huge hand of fate was poking other pieces around the cockamamie game board of life. Having a little fun, eh, big guy? You know, Chief, Mr. Verder, he's pretty raw over you ditching him yesterday. Oh yeah, kicking and snorting. Mr. V, I says. Everything's gonna be everything. Just let me chaw with the man, so here I is. I ain't got you pissed, Walter. Me too. Imagine wasting solid gold caps on a brute like that. Shut up, Deke. See, Mr. V figures he buys you a $2,000 suit. That means you owe him. And after all, it is an awfully nice tent. Now hold on, Walter. I was just kidding! Some of those pieces are dang big, too. Nearly as big as the hand of fate itself. While other pieces, heck, I don't even know how they got on the board. The nerve averter, throwing me out on my ear. And Walter, batting me around like a toy. Jeez, people living in the street and the city shells out $1,400 for some lion's solid gold bridge work. Disgustful. Hey, you listening to me? No, boys, I'm not. And should you care to call about anything but a real job again, think twice on it. 
I got no interest in your problems. That's what bartenders are for. But we are gonna pull a job. A big one. Just gotta figure out what it's gonna be. Hey, did you just say something about a lion? Anywho... But if we're not really in trouble, how come it took all day to get your car out of the police garage? Hugo, please. My forbearance has been sufficiently tested for one day. Rick! Where the hell have you two been? Arch, we... Judas Priest, what have you done to my apartment? I didn't... It could rain on my comics! My books! Oh, the pupil stage is critical for my monarch. If you've disturbed it, I think I'm gonna have an asthma attack. Screw that bug! Ben has the mask now! <sighs> ben? I don't... how? I came back here to dump it. It was freaking me out. I couldn't take it anymore. But Ben snagged it, and he's totally bugged, too. Oh, what now? Well, I tried to follow him when he split, and that was a bust. But on the way back to the apartment, I pulled this off a telephone pole. Our boys are on the move, and there's a third guy with them. Must be the one who speaks no evil. Okay, Lionel, let's stay with them. Which will lead us back to... Do-Re-Mi! I changed my mind. I want 40% of the door. No. Make it 45%. With the money you're saving us on a stage crew, you can have it! Now you get out there and wail on that axe! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, peoples and puppets, I gotta lay some ground rules here. Rule number one, I work my magic. Rule number two, you love it. No exceptions. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. The most important rule. Rule number three, try to control yourselves. You're just too good to be true! Can't take my eyes off of you! Huh? This ain't right. You'd be like heaven to touch! I wanna hold you so much! I don't know, Lionel. Maybe these kids are just out on the town. Hey, look what the Hand of Fate is up to now! Uh, Lieutenant? No, no, really. Used to be, I could smell a bad guy a mile away. Now, I don't know. I'm not sure I can tell the wolves from the sheep anymore. Lieutenant, that is most definitely a wolf. Yeah, that's me, folks. All sticky eyes. Thank you, but no need for gifts. You suck! Tell me about it, but I've got no control. It's like I'm just a car and the mask is the driver. Continuing my tribute to the suaviest of the suave, I'll amaze you with one of his early hits. Let me through. I've got to get in there. Save your money, dude. The music chews it. Don't cry! Just like that, I snapped out of my weirdo lounge lizard trance. Hey there, handsome! What's with the swords? The chainsaw run out of gas? It came down with a wicked case of bull goose loony fever. Ben, this is Rick. You're losing it, dude. Time to bail. Back off, Pee-wee. I came here to play this guitar. And that's what I'm gonna do! Timber! Mom was right. I should have taken up the piano instead. No, this speaker won't go with any of my ties. It's just a bit too loud. Tarsen! Hadn't we better go? I think I've suffered enough for my art. I see you, you lying bastards. I friggin' see you. How did the police get here so fast? You Nancy's worry too much, you know that? We'll just take the back way. But this place doesn't have a back way. No, only an exit. How many years have passed since then? Five? Five and a half? Actually, it was only 20 minutes ago. Still plenty of time to mull over what went down. Time enough for me to scope what I guess you knew all along. This only makes nightmares come true. Ben! Man, we couldn't keep up with you. Hey, don't put that thing back on, okay? Archie wants to talk to you. Um, were you talking to somebody back there? Cause like, I didn't see nobody. Yeah, well, the mask makes you do some crazy things. 